Hi all, um, we're going to get uh, started today with a fast abs class, so just 20 minutes, hopefully something you can do at home on your lunch break uh, with no kit needed. So just to run through, it's going to be four exercises, 40 seconds work, 20 seconds rest, and we're going to go for four rounds. Each round will have a minute rest in between as well as the 20 seconds at the back end of the last exercise. Um, so a good amount, like I said, it will take 20 minutes. You won't get too sweaty, so you can get straight back into work at home. Um, so let's give it a go. Okay. Right, then first exercise is plank. We're gonna go for 40 seconds in this position. Um, if you need to at any stage, you can drop down to your knees like so. But if we can go uh, as long as we can before we need to. So we're halfway through. Start feeling a bit of a shake in your tummy region, which is good. It's what we want. Two, one. Just pop that up a bit so we can hear it. Okay, so on to leg raises. Okay, so flat on his back, hands under his bum for comfort. I'm just going to lift those legs up. If this is something you struggle with, you do one at a time with one leg fully down, heel on the floor. If you're fine with these, you can do it without touching heels on the floor at all. So you should feel this at the bottom of your tummy and right at the top of your legs. That's it. Okay, so we're going for heel taps next. So this position, all we're doing, hands by the side like this, and we're aiming right hand to right heel, and then same on the opposite side. So if you can, we'll just keep those shoulder blades off the floor to make it a little bit harder. So you can actually feel that straight away. So keep it going, 10 seconds. Well, well done. Okay, so same position. Gonna go into a crunch or a sit up, whichever, whichever you can manage. So, hands on thighs and fingertips up towards your knees. If I just turn to the side, let's see a bit better. Keep going, just reaching up towards those knees. Ten seconds. Should definitely be feeling it now. Okay, good. Right. So we've got this twenty seconds rest plus a full minute. So just give those uh, those muscles time to recover. It's not very often we do uh, a workout where it's solely on one muscle group or part of the body. So you will get fatigued. You will get fatigued quite quick. Okay. So uh, big deep breaths. That's one out of the four done. Um, I'll give you another variation on the sit-up or crunch on the next round and then you can choose which ones 
uh, best suited to you. Whew. Give you another option as well on the plank. So you can do a higher plank, which is um, press up position rather than down on your elbows. So if you are struggling with that one, um, I'll go through that one at the start of the next round. So if you wanted to change that up, you can do. Got another 20 seconds, guys. So just get yourselves ready to start. I'm just slightly do it on an angle just so you can see. Okay, going in five. So this plank in press up position. From there, we just hold this position very similar to the other one. Again, a bit of shaking around the tummy is good, normal. Two, one. Well done. Okay, back to them leg raises. Okay, five seconds. Get ready. Again, if you need to do one leg at a time, that's fine. Done. Okay, back to heel taps. Uh, Tommy's going to start hurting pretty soon, I think. Okay, five seconds. Okay, variation on the uh, crunch then, just a full sit up, going in five. I'll start hands behind and all the way up. Five. Good, well done. Okay. Halfway through. We've got uh, plenty of rest. So we've got another minute. Another four minutes rest. And then back into it. So I'm going to leave you with the option whether... You want to do the high or low plank and what sit up you prefer. The other two will keep the same throughout. So just, uh, just rest up. 
might be uh, worth getting up and uh, just having a walk around. Okay, oh, 20 seconds. Hopefully this will uh, break up the day. Get a bit of movement done in between that uh, working at home if you are working from home. Okay, five seconds, plank position. Forget if you need to drop to your knees. Three, two, one. Well done. Okay, back on those leg raises. and controlled. Last five. All done. Okay, back on those heel taps. You just remember, if you can get those shoulder blades off, off the floor, just make this one a little bit more challenging. Okay, three, two. Last ten. Well done. Okay, we can choose again which type of uh, sit up or crunch you want to do. Last one this round. Okay, going in three. Hey guys, one minute from now, just got four more working sets, so just uh, four minutes. I hope you're managing all right. So let us know how you get on.
You will uh, definitely feel this tomorrow though. It's normally uh, when you're sitting up from bed, getting out of bed first, uh, first thing. That's when you know. Ooh. So yeah, tomorrow or the day after, it'll get you. Right, 10 seconds then guys, last round. So you choose that plank, whichever's uh, most comfortable for you. Okay, three, two, one. Don't forget, if you need to go on your knees, you can go on your knees on both planks. So if you're in the high one as well, Okay, we're halfway. Come on, 10 seconds, strong as we can. Three, two, one. Well done. Okay, leg raises. seconds ready to go Five. Well done. Okay, two minutes left. So we've got heel taps first, and then your crunches or sit ups. Okay. Going in three. Good, last 10. Just keep it going. Hold on. Okay. Really feeling that in the midsection now. 20 minutes, definitely enough. Okay, five seconds. Halfway. <clears throat> Only guys could talk through that last bit. Okay, so that's the first uh, fast abs class. Um, well done if you've taken part. Let us know how you've got on, and uh, we'll see you again soon. Bye.